I am Guillermo Wilde, I am anthropologist from the National Scientific Council of Argentina and I am also associate professor at the University of San Martin. I am here at Brown University for a short term research stay with the Sarmiento Fellowship and I will be here developing a project on religious conversion. I am interested in the uh, in how uh, missionaries and uh, indigenous peoples uh, interact um, in the process of expansion of the Iberian uh, empires. I would say that my general question or my big question in this uh, comparative research is about um, how Christian faith is imposed on uh, a variety of uh, indigenous peoples during the colonial period and how these peoples react. So it's a project about negotiations, about uh, uh, also, of course, about, about violence and clashes, but also negotiations, adaptations, which to my mind is not only a religious, uh, strictly religious uh, process, but also a political process, a, a cultural process. Uh, here for this uh, short-term stay at Brown, I will, I, I, I propose to, to develop a project on uh, what I call missionary knowledge. As we know, the missionaries, especially Jesuit missionaries during the colonial period, produced uh, uh, a lot of documents of descriptions of indigenous societies and uh, in those descriptions, they, um, that's one of my arguments, they um, in some way manipulated uh, the knowledge about those societies in order both to uh, reach those societies in a, in a proper way and also um, communicate that knowledge to a European society. So, my question is, what is not a missionary, missionary knowledge? Is it a, a knowledge that we could define in some way as an anthropological knowledge about those societies? Or is it uh, simply a way um, to, um, to uh, transform indigenous societies? What is that knowledge for?